Hello everyone, how are you doing today? So this is the 2nd of March and this is on Tuesday. So today, um, I would like to talk about the importance of Kumo breakout and especially how we can capture these Kumo breakouts of fake. So um, I am a Japanese writer who is in Tokyo, Japan and I have been using Ichimoku Kinko Hyo as uh, uh, my main strategy. So um, so here is a euro data and this is a daily chart and you can see that this is in a range still so this the market goes up and down right now it's bearish and the market just broke the previous low and also um, the market just broke the Kumo downwards today so you might think that this is a Kumo breakout and the market continue to go down this way but for me, um, I don't think so because uh, this Kumo breakout can be fake and let me give you the reasons why this Kumo breakout can be fake and the market might go backwards still and one of the reasons is that the um, this Kumo is flat still you can see the Senko Span B flat and Senko Span A is pointing downwards now but this is still a uh, range as a whole so this is still range to me and also um, I don't see the Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Dead Cross yet um, I have to uh, see the Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Dead Cross before this Kumar break happens but it didn't happen beforehand so that's another reason why I think this Kumo break can be fake and the market might twist backwards anytime soon. And also another reason is that the Chiko span is still too close to the candles. Um, the Chiko span should be uh, far apart from the candles for uh, for this Kumo break and breakout can be reliable. But now this Chiko span is too close, so that's another confirmation why this. Kumo break can be fake. So always remember uh, there are there's a right Kumo breakout and wrong Kumo breakout. And I think that in this case this can be wrong Kumo breakout because uh, of these confirmations. So once again, uh, Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Dead Cross should happen before the Kumo break breakout. And also the Chikou Span should be uh, below the candles and it has to be in distance between Chikou Span and the candles for this Kumo breakout to be reliable but now um, none, of these, none of these are happening and also the Kumo is still, still flat so this Kumo break can be fake so that it might go up for soon and that's why I'm not on the trade in this case I don't think this is downtrending and I, I see that this is still in a range in the daily chart so this is not the timing for me to sell yet so I hope you enjoyed today's video. It was a brief video, but I hope you liked it. So uh, I hope uh, if you liked it, please press, press a good button and please subscribe and click the bell button so that you get notified as I do these videos and lives every day on my YouTube channel. So I hope to see you on the next video or live. And until then, please stay healthy and stay gold. All right. Mata ne. Bye for now. Thank you.